happy vlogmas week two i'm so excited to be starting another vlog for vlogmas let's hope we have a very fun week we're starting off this week pretty lazy today i'm very lazy because it is pouring outside it is so disgusting out so i just want to like lay in bed today well not lay in bed i'm going to just edit all day today i'm going to edit two videos today i'm going to try to bang them out that's like all i'm going to do today so we're starting off this week's vlog on a little bit of a boring note but it is what i have to do yeah i'm gonna edit now all day long so should be fun hey guys i'm sorry to disrupt the vlog but this portion of the video is sponsored by forever 21 thank you so much to forever 21 for sponsoring this part of the video i'm so excited i have so many sick clothes to show you guys forever 21 has really stepped up their game i ordered so many cool clothes and i'm just so excited to show them to you guys i'm gonna try them all on and show you them we're gonna make this kind of a little speed round because i got a lot of clothes so everything will be linked down below make sure you check everything out they have the cutest holiday pieces right now and a lot of good gifts if you are looking to shop for any of your family or friends for Christmas or Hanukkah or any holiday that exists so yes okay let's try them on first they sent me this hoodie and I love it it's so comfortable it's just like the perfect basic white hoodie and I just paired it with these green cargo pants. I'm obsessed with these. They fit me literally perfectly. And they're just so cute. They're perfect for the holiday winter season. And then I got this jacket that I would throw over top of it. It gives me very much like city girl vibes. And I'm living for it. Big fuzzy jacket it looks bomb it just gives me bougie vibes and i'm obsessed with it next i got these pants which i feel like are the perfect like lounge pants just around the house they're like these flared black pants they're so comfortable i'm going to be literally living in these i just paired it with this plain little black crop top i also got this robe that I'm obsessed with it. I think I'm gonna give it to my mom though because she, I don't know, I just can tell she would love it. It is just this white fuzzy robe. So comfortable, so long, perfect for winter. Just throw it on. I would wear this to like lounge around. I am obsessed with it. It's so, so, so soft. It has little pockets here. So cute. Next, I got this little sweatsuit set. I love the color. It is so cute. And this sweatshirt is just adorable. It's like a corset sweatshirt it's just so flattering but so comfortable at the same time i can tell i will also be living in this i have been really stocking up on the loungewear recently because it is just an essential because i never leave the house these are the most comfortable pants you will ever put on your body that is all that needs to be said about them everyone needs them they're so freaking soft and i love these we'll also be living in these Okay, this might be my favorite thing of this haul. It is like a fuzzy set. I don't know if you could tell, but it's literally so soft and fuzzy. And it's a set. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with this. Okay, I know I've been saying that I'm gonna be living in everything, but this one, I like mean it. Like I'm literally gonna be living in this because it's my favorite thing ever. It's black, which is my favorite color of clothing. And it is fuzzy, which is another favorite thing of mine. I again think everybody needs this because it is so comfortable. Okay, I'm obsessed. Wow, this is my new favorite thing that I've ever touched. Next, I got these basic black ripped jeans. I don't know how I don't have any black ripped jeans. I have a lot of black jeans, but not a lot of black ripped jeans. Forever 21 jeans are slept on. They're actually really flattering. They always fit me really well, and I'm short, and they fit me perfectly. So I got these in a size 26 for reference. I love them. Next, I got this gray crew neck i love crew necks this one is really perfect because it is super super like oversized and big and i love it i really don't need any more sweatshirts but i keep getting more sweatshirts but this one has like a little turtleneck action happening so it's a little different also it has angels on it like i needed it it's so cute it's a really pretty color too so i needed this shirt i needed it a looney tunes t-shirt it's so cute like i needed it and look at the back enough said it's perfect it was everything i needed and more next i got this brown long sleeve crop top i've been obsessed with anything brown lately so i had to get this one the back really sold me it's just so cute very simple but a nice twist on a basic top this shirt is amazing i know right now it just looks like a plain black shirt you're kidding you're kidding the way it shows off my butterfly tattoo 
Like, you're kidding. Oh my god, it's so cute. Wow. This shirt, guys. This shirt is beautiful. Like, the collar. The collar. The quilt. The quiltedness of it. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. A nice little basic moment. Throw a crew neck over it. Cute. Perfect for layering. Perfect for everything. Nice basic. 10 out of 10. Everyone needs a nice basic gray turtleneck shirt. Period. The fact that I live in New York and didn't own a black puffer jacket should be illegal, but I got one and it is my favorite thing in the entire world now. It is so cute and fantastic and will 100% keep me warm. So yes, period. She is a queen and I'm obsessed with her. Yet another basic. I'm gonna have to rate her a 10 out of 10. The perfect little black top. Everyone needs one. The way this top is my new obsession. This trend of the little collared things underneath vests I'm obsessed with and this one is just super easy because it comes connected so it makes it very convenient and she's cute she's cute I love her you'll definitely be seeing this one on my Instagram I'm obsessed with this top it just makes me feel like a cool little rocker chick I am vibing with it I love her I love her it says higher than heaven Period. Next I got this cute little cami. It's like all lacy and stuff. Just a really nice basic. Throw it on with anything. Perfect. It's very comfortable also and stretchy and a very nice material. I like it a lot. So anything that is fluffy really just grabs my attention. It's so soft and I just feel like I am being hugged by a blanket in it and I love it. But I also feel like a princess. Something about these sleeves and like the way the top goes like that makes me feel like a princess and I want to feel like a princess every day of my life. So I'll be wearing this for many of those days. Um, I love it. 10 out of 10. The last piece that I got are these little socks. They have candy canes and sloths on them and I just needed them in my life once again. Loved them. Anyway, that is everything that I got from Forever 21. So thank you so much to Forever 21 for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. You guys definitely need some of these pieces in your life. So either go get them or ask for them for Christmas or buy somebody them because these pieces are literally all amazing. Forever 21 has stepped their game up. Everything is a 10 out of 10. Like literally everything I got, I'm obsessed with. So I'm very happy. Everything will be linked down below once again. Go check it out and let's get back into the vlog. Update, it is 4 p.m. Still raining outside, still editing, but I have a couple of packages. First, I got one from Curology. I think that this is just my month's products. I just ran out of my moisturizer, so it would make sense. Yep, like treatment, moisturizer, and face cleanser. They send them to me every single month. I actually use it and actually love it. I have no idea what this is, like what looks sus, but. Oh, I bought this so long ago off of an Instagram ad. It's from Beautiful Earth Boutique and they have like rings. Well, they have jewelry and I ordered this ring literally so long ago. <laughs> it's kind of dope. It's like a little smiley face with a chain. I don't know. Kind of dope. I look like an e-boy right now. <laughs> I actually like really like it. Oh yeah. That's dope. Also, I got um, sugar in my iced coffee today. And I don't normally ever, ever, ever have sugar in my iced coffee. I used to. Every single time I got iced coffee would ask for sugar in it. But now I don't. And it literally tastes so bad. I can't even drink it. I hate the way it tastes. So I'll never make that mistake again. Anyway, I'm going to go. Feeling very good vibes today. But very like lazy vibes, you know. It's just a lazy editing day. Tee <laughs> Look at my bags, holy sh**. I'ma go to sleep, it is like 2 a.m. I just finished editing because I procrastinated like a mofo today. Yeah, that wasn't good. But it's okay because I finished everything I had to do. Even though it's 2 a.m., I still finished everything. All right, I will see y'all in the morning. Good morning. I literally just filmed myself making my coffee except for the fact that I actually just never hit the on button, so. Love that for me. 
Happy December 1st, guys. I started Vlogmas like a little bit early, a week early to like be caught up on everything, but it is officially December. It is officially Christmas, basically. But yeah, I just showered. I blew out my hair and I'm about to get ready on TikTok Live. I literally always am freaking on there getting ready, but it is fun to do. I'm getting ready because I have to film a story ad thing for this brand deal that I'm doing on Instagram. That's pretty much it right now. I also want to try to go shopping later by myself to see if I can find my family some gifts for Christmas maybe. Yeah, I'll see you guys when I am all ready. I am now ready. Oh my god, guys. It is like four o'clock now and I literally was on live with y'all for ever like we were on there forever now i'm in a group chat with you guys on instagram and it's so cute i literally love you guys so much you don't even understand really make sure you follow me on all other social media platforms because i really try to connect with you guys as much as i possibly can um it's so much fun i literally swear i talk to you guys on live more than i talk to my own friends <laughs> so but now i am filming a Instagram like brand deal thingy. So that's what I'm doing now. And then after I'm done with this, we're going to go, me and you, I promise I'll pay attention to you guys today because I have been all over the place this morning. But um, I'm gonna go to a couple of stores and see if I can find any cute little Christmas presents. That's what we're doing. I was just talking to myself because I didn't click the record button. I keep doing that today. What the f is wrong with me? Anyway, I just got here. I'm at Ticey's Corner in New Jersey. If you are curious where um, like a good anthro is in the area, it's huge. That's how big it is. It's literally massive. And then Hallmark's right next door. So I'm gonna go to those two. Mom, if you are watching this, it is your cue to leave. Um, unless you don't wanna be surprised. Um, that'd be kind of mean. So please, please don't watch. Okay, Loki just hit jackpot at Hallmark. I'm gonna go into Anthro, but I might not get anything because I could always come back. But I know that the stuff at Hallmark sells out. So I'm gonna go to Anthro now. I hate vlogging in stores, so I'm not going to. Okay, I went into Anthro, but I didn't buy anything because I don't know, I just didn't really feel like it. I'm really hungry, wanna go home, but it was nice to look around there. They have the cutest like Christmas decorations and stuff. Definitely wanna come back here with my mom to look at Christmas decorations together because we love looking at Christmas decorations. Maybe we'll do that this week. Maybe we'll do that next week, we'll see. But I found some good stuff at Hallmark. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I got something for my dad and two things for my mom. So if you're either of those people, please click off this video because this is a surprise. But I found this like coffee table type book and I got it for my dad because my dad loves cars and I saw it and I just knew that it was like perfect for him. It's called A Man in His Car and it just like has like a bunch of pictures of cars and like stories and shit in it. I don't know. I just thought it would be kind of cute for my dad. So I got him that and then I got my mom this little t-shirt and it says... This is my Hallmark Channel movie watching shirt because my mom loves the Hallmark Channel's Christmas movies and just movies in general. They're so cheesy, but she loves them. So I got her that and I'm so excited because every year she like, I don't know, like I feel like she always kind of like hints at wanting them and then every time I come to Hallmark, um, they never have them because they sell out so freaking fast because these moms love their Hallmark movies. So I made sure to come early this month. So then I got a little wine glass and it says, Dear Santa, please bring me all the Hallmark Channel movies yeah that's what i got my mom and my dad starting kind of early with buying christmas presents this year normally i feel like i don't shop until like the end more towards christmas but getting an early start but yeah i'm gonna text my family and see if like they're planning on making dinner or not because if not maybe i'll get chipotle or something megan nicole this song summer forever by megan megan nicole just came on do you guys remember this Please let me know how I remember every word to Summer Forever by Megan Nicole when I haven't heard that song since like middle school yet I couldn't remember a single thing when I was like in school. It beats me. But um, anyway, <laughs> that was kind of fun. At Chipotle, baby. I haven't been to Chipotle in a minute, so I'm hyped. Woo, picking up food for the whole fam. I have secured the bag, baby. I'm so excited to go home and eat. I'll see y'all there. Also, I don't know when I started saying y'all, but recently can't stop saying it. So guess I'm from the South now, LOL. Got our Chipotle. <laughs> Chipotle. Woo. Daily reminder. 
water. Good morning everybody, happy Wednesday. I have a gigantic pimple on my cheek, so please don't look at it, it's really ugly. And now I'm about to go live on TikTok and do my makeup with y'all, so it shall be fun. So that's how I'm starting my day, very fun. I'll see you guys when my makeup is on and I look like a human and I don't have a freaking huge pimple on my cheek, so. I am ready for the day. This outfit I've worn before, you guys have probably seen it. Definitely have made TikToks in it, but I haven't gotten Instagram pictures in it and I really wanted to. So I'm wearing it again. This is the fit. Have on this jean jacket that I thrifted over this Princess Polly, just like black bodycon dress. And then this cow print bag, which I think adds a lot to the fit. And then I have it on with my black docs. I think it's so cute. I'll probably make a couple of TikToks now and then force Nick to drive around with me and find somewhere cool to take pictures, so. That's the plan, Stan. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that, okay. See y'all in a minute. Hey, we're taking pics now and I'm freezing recently. I have been freezing while taking my photos, so. We're taking pictures in this parking lot. Nick is committed. Nick is committed if the vlog can see this right now. <laughs> Yo, let's just leave the camera on the top of the car. Oh no. Hey guys. Oh, and oh no, not a record timing. Last time was five minutes. I got a TikTok and pictures, the brown dress. Five minutes, but this time, nine minutes. Okay. Got them. Thanks to photographer. Bye. Okay, I just got home, but I'm about to leave again. I put on sweatshirt and sweatpants because it's cold out and I was just freezing. Just did it for the gram. All I do is for the gram. It is what it is. Okay, anyway, I'm going with my dad now to the post office because I want to open a PO box, but I just want like a place where I can give you guys an address to because I always get questions like asking if I have one. So I'm going to make one right now. So let's go. Okay, guys, I just opened up a PO box. If you guys want to send me anything, I'll put the address on the screen and in the description box. So yeah, it'll always be in the description box if you ever want to find the address. So I got home from opening the PO box a little bit ago. I've been editing my Instagram pictures go follow me on Instagram and like the pics I took today. Yeah, I did that and now I'm going with my mom to Bath and Body Works and we're gonna pick out some holiday candles and I'm so excited to finally get some Christmas candles. I'll show you guys what we get. I wasn't recording that whole time. I keep doing this. Uh -huh. I was just saying that we are at Bath and Body Works. Okay, bye. I'm excited. Uh, okay, we just came say. out. Look at the Christmas tree. So at Bath and Body Works, I'll show you guys the candle. So first, I think that this is my mom's. It's sugared snickerdoodle. Then I think, did I get or you get marshmallow fireside? We both did. I got this. It's snowy peach berry. Smells so good. Berry. And then I got peppermint sugar cookie. Smells so good. I love that one. I'm gonna re smell it. I also got cinnamon and clove buds. It smells so good. Then another marshmallow fire sign, because we both got that. And then my mom got spiced gingerbread. Oh, and she got some hand sanitizers. And then the rest of everything that we got are gifts. So you do not get to see that. Now we're gonna decide where we're gonna go pick up dinner and we'll let you know what we do. We ended up getting some Chinese food. Now I'm with my mommy. Mommy? <laughs> 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 and we're about to watch The Bachelorette. Woo -woo. Yeah, I just came up with this new term um, and I want everyone to start using it now. I'm not sure if it's already a thing, but I've never heard anyone say it. So no. it is juice. <laughs> It is store juice and it is used in the context of like I'm gonna add this to Urban Dictionary. Look at my eyes. Probably already there. Probably. Like let's say you say like OT, like you're like, ooh, juice. Okay. Like you know, it kind of flows off the tongue nice and like I really like it. So please start using that when you're like gonna say OT. Just think of me and say ooh juice. <laughs> Oh my god, you're an idiot. And, and like, please give credit to me. So, because I started the word. And uh, it, I, think, I think it might be. <laughs> <laughs> I, 
I think it might. I think it might be something good. Yeah. Like I'm thinking. I think this might be the one. You know. <laughs> it's, like, it's like the lot. It's the lottery ticket. <laughs> You're not. It's in Urban Dictionary. Fuck. Juice, street credibility, and or respect. Like, no. Yeah, no, this isn't a thing. So, I'm starting it up. Juice, tell your friends, tell your mother, tell your father, tell your boyfriend, tell your girlfriend, tell your sister, tell your dog, tell your cat. Amanda Palatano came up with, ooh, juice. Okay. I'm gonna, tra I'm gonna trademark it, um, so nobody <laughs> steal my idea. Bye. Well, where is this Get out of bed. Like, oh, maybe you will now. Do you hear me? How you doing, dude? Do you have anything to say? You got anything to say to the people? All right, I got him up. <laughs> Another morning, another meditation. Hey guys, okay, I literally am keeping my mask on because I look so ugly today, but I'm about to go pick up a bacon, egg, and cheese. I'm editing all day today, and I'm really lazy to make breakfast today, if I'm honest. I don't want to, so I'm gonna go pick up a bacon, egg, and cheese, and then sit in my room and edit my ass off today. I wanna get two videos done because the next week is gonna be pretty busy for me, work-wise. So I wanna get things done in advance, but I just got a package from IMG. I ordered this on Black Friday. Literally, I think this is like the only thing that I bought on Black Friday, so I wanna show you guys. They were on like the slightest sale, and I was like, oh, I need them. I've been wanting these for a little bit now. Carly has them, and they're just so flattering, so I copied her. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna have to get them tailored, but they're the black like, like legging type pants that like tie up around your waist, and they're so flattering. They tie all around your waist. But yeah, I'm gonna go pick up my food, and then, come home and edit my ass off. Um, I forgot to show you guys my food, but I basically ate it all. So I'm gonna finish this and then edit and I'll see you guys um, probably in a long time. Good morning. Good morning, happy Friday. Today I am going to see a psychic. So I'm pretty nervous. I just got ready on TikTok Live and my room is now kind of a mess. Um, I'll clean it later. Um, yeah, I have a psychic appointment at 2.30 and it's like 1.30 now. I'm really kind of nervous. My mom has gone to him and he is phenomenal. Like I know so many people that have gone to him and he's just amazing. I'll let you guys know how it goes afterwards. I'm probably not going to tell you guys too much of what he said just because it's definitely going to be very personal, but um, we'll see. I'm nervous. I'm excited. I'm with my mom. She's going to wait outside for me, but I'm about to go into the psychic. I'll let y'all know how, um, <laughs> how it goes. Hey guys, I just got out of the psychic. It was very good. He knew everything about me, pretty much. So yeah, I'm not gonna tell you anything that he said because it should be private. It's private information, but he was really amazing. Can put this in? Um, but now we are getting donuts and coffee from this place called Boxer Donut, and I'm very excited to try it. We'll give you guys a little taste test. Um, situation anyway Everybody? that was a very cool psychic greeting i'll tell you one thing he said to me the first thing he said when i sat down was are you planning to move to california and i was like bruh <laughs> that's all i'm gonna tell you guys but it was really cool and really good anyway i can't wait to try these donuts and i will be back when we have donuts Ooh. Look how cute. these look bomb and they smell that's so rude. good very strong you can see how dark it it's is. It's good. Okay, which one should I try? Ooh, that crunch sounded good. Mmm. It's like moist on the inside. All right, I need another piece of it. That's good. That's amazing. Everyone, Boxer Donut, Nyack, New York. That is a good donut. That is a really good donut. Now I want to try another one. Mmm. Mmm. This is an old fashioned can donut. Can you break me up a piece of it? This is good. Ooh. Here's how it is. 
You don't it's love good. it? It's good. What is it? Gingerbread. All right. Now I gotta have a little tiny piece of it. It's good. It's different for sure. But it has a good flavor. I like it. Yeah, I like it too. What was the cream on top? Can you get the camel? I don't know. Anyway, donuts have been a 10 out of 10 experience. Is it good? I would go. Better than Dunkin' Donuts or no? No. No. Hey guys, so I am back home now. I am going to end this vlog here because it is the end of Friday and I'm just chilling for the rest of the night editing. So I'm just gonna end this now. I hope that you guys enjoyed week two of Vlogmas. Make sure to stay tuned for week three and for Tuesday's video. I love you all. Tune back and I'll talk to you in my next vlog. Bye guys. Mwah.